Hey everyone, uh, my name is Fitzy64, and today I have a uh, fairly unusual video for this channel. Uh, this is going to be a uh, tech review of Raycon earbuds one year after I've gotten them. Kind of show you guys how how they've how they've held up or how they haven't really held up. So yeah, you know, here they are. Um, these are the uh, Raycon Performer E55 earbuds. They are currently on sale for $120. Although I got them at about 80 bucks. Right off the bat, let's talk about the casing because that's the very first thing you see when you get these. So the casing is still all right. Got a few scratches on it. It's not horrible. A few dings on the sides from where I've dropped it. But besides that, it's fine. And I'm sure as many of you guys can see, I've got this little piece of tape down here and I'm not sure if it's my genetics fault or uh, if it's the fault of the case, but I find it very difficult to open this case and it's magnetic, so I just hold on to the piece of tape and I pull it out. And as you see, the Raycon earbuds have just turned on. But um, yeah, so that is the case. The one gripe I have about the case really is the fact that if you, if you jangle it, especially if you drop it on the ground, then the top of the, it, it, or what the magnetic pops off, and uh, the earbuds go flying everywhere. But besides that, it's fine. Not much to complain about uh, besides the inability to open up the case sometimes. Uh, but now let's go on to the earbuds. I've got them. Uh, yeah, so I've got the left one and right one right here. They go into my ears just fine. In fact, I'll uh, show you guys. I'm not listening to anything with my earbuds in, but Yep, they go into my ears just fine. It's good. There's a few scuffs on like, what? From wear and tear uh, and dropping it on the sides. But besides that, it looks aesthetically fine. I've only used the stock earbuds. The or You can switch the ear mold. You can't really see it though, but yeah, you can switch the ear mold onto this. But uh, I've always used the stock ones, so uh, I can't really tell you guys about the other types. About probably three months into having the earbuds, there is normally a, a piece of... Let's see if I can angle this correctly. There's normally a piece of, of mesh uh, that is over this hole right here. But that fell off uh, because the stickiness of it degraded over time. But, I mean, besides that, it's, it's fine. The... Losing the mesh part doesn't affect your ability to hear the music at all. It's just kind of like a, a baseline protective. It, it protects the inside of the earbud, but um, unless you're gonna like just douse this with water, it's not gonna go in because the hole's so small. But yeah, besides that, uh, the earbuds, they pair just fine. Uh, I still get basically six hours of a charge every time I uh, put them in. I don't use them for six hours, but uh, whenever I've, I've tested them, they've, they've always lasted for six hours. So they still they still hold up. Yeah, th there isn't much more to say uh, beyond that. The Raycon earbuds, they, they hold up after a year of use. The case can be a bit tricky, and then you, you can lose a very small, unimportant piece of it that doesn't affect the earbuds as a whole but really those are my only two gripes about it. They charge up just fine. The case maintains a, a solid charge over a year of use. The earbuds maintain a solid charge over a year of use. There isn't much degradation over time. Uh, so unless <laughs> Raycon's purposely planned it out so that uh, they crap out after just over a year, I'd say that these are a pretty good pair of earbuds. And if you're looking for something that won't fall out of your ears, has a good charge, and just generally does everything you need, and also has the general noise cancelling capabilities, I definitely recommend getting these earbuds. They uh, are definitely, they were definitely worth the investment in my opinion, and uh, hopefully you guys can say the same if you guys get your own uh, pair of Raycon earbuds. So yeah, that's all there is to say.